Okay, welcome to Wing Canton. Oh, and they're already away here. We got here a little bit sharp. The rising star novices chase. We're already over the first, which is the water here in Somerset. As we wait for them to settle down, I'll try and go through the card as we missed it. Gonna be led by Linford Skipper. There's one of Graham Clutterbuck's two horses here. He's got a second called Dapple Grey. The outside of that is made to be strong. On the Beckwith Stables. Get to the third, which is a ditch. Everybody's over it. They're followed through by Volcano, Volcano Eruption and Go to Town against the fence. Leon Van Rensburg. There's the Grey. As I said, Dapple Grey. And we've got David Robertson's uh, Creaking Peking. Out wide is, uh, I think, a Dunlight Lend. Which is from Darren Thompson. And we've got a couple back to All Looks Good. Long Wave. Reap What You Sow and Powder Gamba. They're over the fifth. There's no fewer than seven previous winners in this race out of 11, so it should be quite a cracker. Although, uh, reap what you sow towards the rear. The great just dropping back now. We've lost one, sorry, I didn't see Power Gamba went there, um, which is bad luck for, I think, Craig Allen's horse. But up front, it's Linford Skittler that still leads us from Made to be Strong Volcano Eruption. There you one, two, three. And we've got about a length or so back to the two together. Dapple Great inside of him is Go to Town. The outside of that is Creek and Pekin, the Black Horse. Oh, didn't go over that fence at all well. And that first of Joshua Sutherland's All Looks Good. The outside of that is Dunlight Lend. The ground at the back, Reap What You Sow. And the right of the rear at the moment is Long Wave. So they're through 7 of 19. And they've all negotiated that well. So it's Linford Skittler. Made to be strong on his outside. Got about a three length advantage from Dapple Grey and Volcanic Eruption. Two time winner on his last two races. <coughs> Excuse me. So I'll be looking to make it a three in a row for Leon. And that is stable mate go to town as they make the ninth. Oh, and it was a poor jump there by Dapple Grey, but I'm saying we've lost Long Wave as well. He's unseated his rider. I missed that as well. I think that was at the eighth. We're going to go past the grandstand here. Finishing post. A circuit to go. A further nine fences to jump. It's Linford Skittler that's going to lead them over the next. And made to be strong. Volcanic eruption. The leaders are over it. Nobody else but a mistake and a high jump there by Creaking Peking. But David Robertson. They're all getting a bit strung out now. So make the 11th, which is the water, which was the first last time round. And it's Linford Skittler and made to be strong. By three or four to Volcano Eruption. Volcanic eruption, sorry. Double back to all looks good, which it does at the moment. Just at the rear is the successful herd lap. Reap what you sow. Not going around the fences too well. And I think the southern stables have mentioned and trialled particularly well over fences and proving that here as he starts to tail off, I imagine. But it's made to be strong now, just leading by half a neck from Linford Skittler. A length or so back to volcanic eruption. And go to town. Oh, okay, volcanic eruption made a mistake there. Big slow jump at the rear by Dunlight Lend. So it's still Graham Clatterbuck to Linford Skittler. Made to be strong. Three back to volcanic eruption again. They go over this big ditch. They've all made it. They're not doing too bad there. Reap what you sow towards the rear. Running along with Dunlight Lend. As we come inside the six furlongs now, it's Linford Skittler. Made to be strong on his outside. Creek and Pekin's moved up well. On the outside of that is Go to Town. Volcanic eruption and all looks good being pushed along now as there's his dapple grey out wide. But it's Linford Skittler that heads for home first as we come down to half a mile to go. And it's Linford Skittler from Made to be strong. Moving well on the outside now is Volcanic Eruption. And it's Volcanic Eruption that jumps well at the 16th. So it's Linford Skittler. Volcanic Eruption made to be strong. Moving through again is Go to Town on the white inside. is all looks good. Dropping back now is Creek in Peking. Dapple Grey's not going to win from there, I don't think. But it's Volcanic Eruption that leads us inside the three. Volcanic Eruption from Linford Skittler jumps the 17th well. Only got two left to go. So three from home. It's Volcanic Eruption. Linford Skittler just not got a lot left now. I'm not, I don't think any of them was could maybe catch this leader at the moment if he gets over the 18th that's the penultimate so it's volcanic eruption by about four from Linford Skittler go to town made to be strong creaking peaking wide no one no, no room is all looked good he gets to the last but he goes through the top but as he got it's still advantage he looks like he's hanging on here looks around the jockey but it's volcanic eruption I think from go to town I think it's gonna be a one two for Leon Van Rensburg three wins in a row for volcanic eruption from go to town in second third was all looks good he got a bit of room and may well have looked 
better. And that fourth is Linford Skipper, our long-time leader. So a one-two there for Leon. Starts off our races at Wincanton with a nice little uh, winner's enclosure. So Volcanic Eruption takes his third win in a row. Well done, Leon. Second was Go to Town for Leon Van Rensburg. Third was All Looks Good for Joshua Sutherland. Fourth was Linford Skitler for Pontypool Racing. And fifth was Creaking Peak in for Davy Lad.